Today, McLean County residents gathered for a friendly game of softball, but it also had a deeper message. Andy Bernhardt was there at the Corn Crib as those celebrated those on the front lines. She has that story. The community came together to say thank you and cheer on their first responders. One thank you can go a long way. And McLean County residents stressed the importance of saying just that to your first responders. We think that all of the work and hard sacrifice they've made in the last few months here in our community needs deserves a word of thanks and saving lives and helping us stay healthy and helping us protect our homes and our property. All of that. Um, there's not enough words to really say from the bottom of my heart how much I appreciate and how the people gathering here today are doing the same thing. At the Support the Red, White and Blue rally, police officers, firefighters and health care providers battled one another on the field in a friendly softball competition. Local first responders were overwhelmed to see so much support from their community. We're very grateful. Uh, we know we have a lot of support in the community, but it's always nice uh, to be shown in person uh, that support. The event was hosted by the McLean County Republicans with Representative Rodney Davis throwing out the first pitch. The event hit home for him as he recalled the 2017 shooting at a congressional baseball practice where first responders protected his life. There are people that sacrifice every day they leave their home. I got a chance to really thank law enforcement because I wouldn't be alive today without the courage of two African American Capitol Police officers running toward gunfire a few years ago so me and my friends could run off a of gunfire at a baseball field in Virginia. The event also hosted a ball dive for charity with three local organizations fundraising, including the Boys and Girls Club, Community Health Care Clinic, and Team Blue Line. For 25 News, I'm Andy Bernhardt.